And so here are some different design concepts on the Broad Street Market that were prepared by the consulting firm. Um, here's one uh, early implementation. You can see this is done with just simple line painting, gore areas, but you, we're trying to increase the uh, pedestrian space um, in front of the market. Here's a, here's a second, you know, in terms of cost, the second phase. Look at how the uh, crossing on 6th Street, where you have a school up here, look how we've shortened that distance, right, to safely accommodate um, um, th those, cr those pedestrians. And what that does is now you don't have to dedicate, this is a light a signalized intersection, you don't have to dedicate so much time of that signal phase for those pedestrians to cross because they have a much shorter distance. What that'll do is that'll uh, improve the flow of traffic along 6th Street. Now moving up here is the is a third concept. Uh, that's the roundabout. In terms of cost, that would be the most costly. But look how we've improved that plaza area around the Broad Street Market for C uh, you know, seaters, uh, pedestrian travelers, and whatnot. The Broad Street Market's in a resurgence right now. They've asked I've, um, for additional plaza space, and this would accommodate it. Think about what this would do to the one-way traffic, right? Somebody wants to park along the Broad Street Market, they can't find adequate space, so under the current condition, they stop here at a traffic light and have to wait for the light to turn green. Under this concept, they simply go into the roundabout and come right around and find parking. Um, the concept on FIA. Same thing, you have a big traffic generation generator here uh, in this garage. These folks, when they leave the garage, they travel currently, they travel down 7th Street to Riley, and down 6th Street, all, you know, all sitting at all these intersections along the way, and then come down um, on Forrester, westbound on Forrester. Well, under this scenario, they would just simply go into the roundabout and, and right down on Forrester. They wouldn't have to make an illegal U-turn here at Bow Street. They wouldn't have to go all the way down Riley. Here's another concept where that traffic circle is moved uh, in front of the FIA parking lot. Accommodates the pedestrian crossers from the parking lot into the FIA building uh, safely and more efficiently than uh, what's currently there where they're dodging in and out of uh, diagonally parked vehicles.